I know I said that last time it was my last haul, but truly this is the last one. At least I hope. Don't quote me on that. But anyway, I'm getting ready to finish and finalize my tour that I'm decorating. And I bought a few little things and I'm trying to get things out of the garage and whatever I can to finish my last final touches. And I did buy an entire plethora of beautiful, creepy cloths that I found from the 99 cent store and they are so beautiful and very affordable for the prices friends this is a place to get them now i have noticed they're starting to really fly off the shelves now so if you're looking for anything like even this table cover table cover even those are gone at some 99s so i did buy this i didn't know they had spiders but i am scared of spiders but it's okay i'm going to deal with it because i'm going to use the actual uh, black cover under it so it, you can't see it very much i hope anyways you can see i have my decor here all out and ready to decorate to finish decorating rather so i wanted to share these beautiful creepy trees i don't think these spooky trees i don't think i shared them before and they were 49.99 from joann's but of course i got them at 50 percent off so not a bad deal and then i finally found a halloween countdown a little bit late but but that's okay and this was three dollars from family dollar so not a bad deal it is really cute with the beautiful ghost design and the pumpkin as the little marker and look guys i'm sad to say this marshall's 9.99 pumpkin that's so realistic looking actually broke somebody broke it and they won't fess up to it so it is what it is i made both of them pay for it i'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> i should though but anyway i'm gonna keep it and probably use some of that little creepy looking string or wreath on it i don't know we'll see and here's my diy i was not happy with the little blot or the little dabbing that i did with the napkin so now i'm painting it my son says it looks like it has a beard now <laughs> but anyway here's the difference the one on the right obviously are the ones here they are and the final reveal i guess they yeah so here they are i wasn't jiving with that distressed look but anyway i am kind of distressed because look i went buying more things pun intended with the distress but anyway so here are the things that i brought i had these in my car 12.99 from Didi's discount they are so very pretty i don't like to buy a lot of throws that are specific to a holiday but i do like to incorporate the colors and i think these were very classy and elegant they may not be the mess best material but i think they're still very high quality and look i found the legend of sleepy hollow pillow at michael's i was so happy i was jumping for joy when i saw it $30 but I got it for $14 and changed with the coupon that I had and the discount they had as well so that was really nice I also bought this for $8.99 this is a Petro from Ross for $8.99 I have two little chihuahuas and I like to color coordinate for the holidays, especially for my tours, which is coming up soon. I know I'm really late, friends. I'm so sorry. But, you know, I got sick with COVID for like three weeks and it was just a mess and life happens. These two little throws are for my puppy whoppies. I use baby blankets for my puppies. So, well, they're not puppies, but they'll be my puppies forever. They're my chihuahua dogs. Anyway, so let's see what else I have in here. A beautiful glam pumpkin and then i have these 5.99 from home goods they're for your pets but i use them as decor which you will see how i use them in just a little bit but i have two of them and i think i bought those last year i want to say i got them from my garage and then these all these are from this year 2.98 from walmart these beautiful lights i hope they turn out okay i'm not really into using a lot of lighting but i want to do more this year so i wanted to step up a little bit i found these at walmart as well and these are the eight function LED and I love only LED because I don't have to connect anything I could move them anywhere so that's what I love about them and there's a hundred of them in there as you could see 698 and those are from Walmart this happy Halloween beautiful little tumblers are from Dollar Tree I believe it says happy Halloween has a haunted house they are so very pretty and I had to pick them up and I have seen them dwindling down now so if you like them find them quickly drizzled popcorn pumpkin spice also from Dollar Tree this is delicious I tried that last year and here I just picked up my little uh, candle snuffer from the garage and also these 
black hands that i think i already shared so those were in the garage as well now this is new from ray dunn i believe these are her new mugs correct me if i'm wrong but it says wicked witch and i love them they're so beautiful so beautiful you guys know when i sing i really love something i love that it has black on the inside they're 5.99 I think they've gone down now in their price range this year, which I was so happy and pleasantly surprised to see. Now, this is $3 from Family Dollar. I think it's so adorably cute. You could put it in anywhere, really, and it's very classy and elegant looking as well. I was clearing out my bedroom and what do I find? A Target bag. Oh my goodness, I forgot I had these. I just bought this this year, not too long ago, maybe a couple weeks ago or a week ago. And let me tell you, everything is flying off the shelves, friends. So if you love something, run to all the stores and get your finals. But anyway, so I got the little bottles. I got this little boo, little ghosty $1. It is so very cute. I do have something like this that I picked up last year that was actually a Frankenstein. So I also bought these beautiful little pumpkins. They're like this woven material, $1 for the little ones. And then I picked up also two of the bigger ones because they're so very beautiful. And then these two little um, smaller ones, but one of them is a little bit off color like a different color and then this one is the orange one that i really love i love just the different shades three dollars for this one and i thought they're so very pretty you could use these not just for fall but also for halloween and carry them on into thanksgiving so these are very versatile and that's what i love about them i had to pick up the little one as well or two little ones rather and it kind of looks like a mickey mouse you can do a diy right I don't know you tell me I'm not much of a DIYer but these little mini potion bottles are everything every time I see them at Target I have to pick them up so they were all a dollar and they're so very pretty and so very whimsy and fun to use look at this one is the cats and the ravens wings oh my goodness I just love them <laughs> Apparently, I like the little bats a lot because I picked up two of those. But these are very inexpensive and so very elegant, spooky, classy. At the same time, I love the jack-o'-lantern so much that I picked up two as well. Look how gorgeous they look. I don't know if I'll be using all the decor that you've seen in my hauls, friends, because I have small spaces. And I did go a little kooky trying to get a lot of things for Halloween so you may or may not see some of the things but at least they're hauled you could see what's out there you can rush to try to find them but these beautiful little pumpkins for one dollar are everything classy glam elegant just the way i love it and for only a dollar that is such a great deal so i had to pick up two of every shade that i saw so very pretty so beautiful <laughs> So I like to use a lot of masks on my tablescapes for New Year's Eve. So when I saw this at the 99, I had to pick it up. I also picked up this beautiful Farm Fresh pumpkin patch sign. And I believe this was from Bargain War. No, it was from Family Dollar for $3. So here are the little cuties, the little pumpkin pet toys that I bought and a little sneak peek on what's to come but i end up changing that just in F fyi for you but you'll see how i change it in my tour but anyway so look at this hocus pocus broom company it is so very cutesy for five dollars at family dollar you can't beat that and i ended up going a little dark and spooky just like i did with my hair what <laughs> so i bought a little hanging decor <laughs> That was my younger son shopping with me at the 99. So I did pick up so a few things that are on the darker, spookier side. Nothing gross or gory, none of that. Welcome, come with me. Let's see what else we bought. Look at these nails. I've done my nails too to match my hair. What? <laughs> Just kidding. My hair is more like a, like a, a golden 
blonde now but anyway that was a cute little hand that i got and i picked these up i went to dollar tree because i needed to pick up a little bit of diy items so i got this the brushes and sponge brush the crazy glue some little gemstones and also some eyeballs because i couldn't find them i don't know what i did with the others that i bought and also these little window decor I don't know if they're like window clings or what they are but i thought they were cute because they're little creepy cute ghosts and i also bought the caution tapes and i got a couple of those beware you can read it there but yeah just very inexpensive a dollar 25 and you know i wasn't planning on going spooky but now it seems like i'm just one of the areas is going to be spooky not the other ones and it's not going to be crazy spooky it's not going to be like super scary but anyway so i bought the, another one of these look how pretty that is you can put it on your window in your kitchen i wanted to buy some more of the black creepy cloth but they were gone so they only had the cream color and then i picked up some pens just random because we always need those and i'm so happy to find those at the dollar tree now the paper mate and or was it the 99 one of those i'm getting confused guys but i think it was a dollar tree and also these from dollar tree they're so very pretty i did have to go to another dollar tree to find them because i found them at first did not pick them up and so now i had to travel like to three different ones but i finally found them i also found the bigger buckets and also these little napkins they are so very classy and elegant very beautiful <laughs> Here's the little buckets I was talking about. You could put some popcorn in there, which is what I plan to do. Or if not, you could put something else, whatever it is you like. But it has all types of little label designs there with the bats and the bones, snakes, and all types of spooky things. <music> How'd you guys like my nails? What? <laughs> Obviously, that's not my hand, but I love this hand. It is so very spooky cute. Actually, my younger son that was shopping with me found it, and I was like, okay, let's take it. It's pretty cool. And that was $1.29 from the 99 cent store. I love that it has like it's a long sleeve, you know, where you could put you could put something under there and make it like an actual arm. So that would be cool. And then we have these little skeletons. Now these hanging skeletons are so very, very good price for this size for $1.49. I've seen them at Dollar Tree. In fact, I was going to get them, but this girl grabbed the whole box. So I was like, what? She didn't even leave me one. But I did find these at the 99. I was so grateful because they're a lot bigger than the ones you find at Dollar Tree. And they have the little chains. So why not? <music> So I bought these little bats. I have the black ones, but I wanted to get the orange color ones because they're also so very glitz and glam. And look at this beautiful skull with the crow. Or is it a raven? I think it's a raven. Anyway, but it's so very beautiful. And I picked up two, but look, one of them's kind of messed up. I'm going to see if I can exchange it today. We'll see. They were $1.49 for each. And I thought they were so very pretty. I just wish they would be a little bit bigger. But they're super cute. And also super cute, these cute little puppy whoopies. They are on top of the jack-o'-lanterns. And, you know, I thought they just reminded me of my doggies. And I had to pick them up. I picked them up for my sons, rather. And also, I got these uh, Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. Beautiful little um, cutesy toy for my pets but i don't know if i'm going to use it for them or if i'm going to use it for decor we'll have to wait and see but i'll look at all these receipts they sure pile on i bought this jack-o-lantern lantern and it was 3.99 which i thought was a great deal because i saw the exact same one at home goods for ten dollars so yes there's that and then i bought these beautiful little cupcake or cupcake stands or you can call them little risers i use them for risers you know, sometimes it's great to raise some of your decor with little cupcake stands or what have you. It really elevates the look on your decor. And that's why I got two of them. And these are from Dollar Tree. Here's an example of how you can use these little risers. You could put these skulls on top of them and it could be like the stand. You could glue them or just leave them there and use them for something else. 
and those were from dollar tree as well they're kind of creepy but i don't know if i'm going to diy them or leave them as is because they kind of match the hand color almost so i want to say i'm going to leave them like that or maybe i should paint them what do you guys think should i paint them black gold i have no idea but uh, i'm going to think about it but it has to be today because i need to finish this decor tour video like soon and friends i also stopped at uh, grocery outlet and i found these cuties 3.99 they're creepy cute not really cute it's more like creepy actually but it does light up and i'm going to share that with you when i start using everything soon in the tour and like i said i'm so sorry that i'm so late but life happens and it is what it is i also bought this toy sword i don't know how i'm going to use it but i thought it was fun and whimsy i love the old style look with that rustic looking gold so i had to pick it up and they do have several options different designs but i really like this one it has a little skeleton there as well and that was from dollar tree <music> these don't they look like jack to you or maybe the sleepy hollow jack-o-lantern that's what it reminds me of and these were $2.99 from the 99 so i had to pick up two they are so kind of cute creepy cute so friends i hope you guys have enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching remember to live well healthy happy and organized many blessings and stay tuned for the tour have a spooktacular halloween